What is up? It's your girl Shoni J reporting to you live from a bedroom in Harlem and I am back with the facts. And today has been such a lazy day. Like, oh my gosh, I've just been sleeping all day. <laughs> I did not get out of my bed until like four in the afternoon. I know, right? <laughs> like I would just keep waking up and like, nah, I'm not ready. Go back to sleep. Waking up, going through some social media stuff, and going right the fuck back to sleep. <laughs> oh man, I've been working hard, you guys. I've been working all week. Did a double the other day. What the fuck? I was like, nah, we're not finally getting a day off. I just want to sleep. So I feel a lot better now. Very, very well rested. I hope the week is going well for you guys. And today, we're going to talk a lot about hair. And I'm going to share some of the frustrations that I've dealt with and that I pretty much still deal with regarding my afro. And I just think it's honestly a fucking shame how... All of the things I'm going to share with you are all outside factors. It's a fucking shame. Like, if I'm going to be frustrated, if I'm going to have frustrations regarding my afro, I want it to be, like, because of me. (laughs) Not because of another motherfucker. Like, wow. It's 2018. And we're still dealing with bullshit like this. So stay tuned for some of the frustrations that I deal with regarding my afro and maybe some of you guys will relate and feel free to leave me a message about any frustrations that you have dealt with or still deal with regarding your afro i want to hear all about it okay and before i jump into it let's listen to some of my music enjoy enjoy 